This is cell block 776. Another day at a range. Getting some good training. Shooters, next course of fire. Two rounds. Upper left hand target. Two rounds. Shooters, ready? Fire! Get that gun running. Let's go, get it running. Alright, right, shooters, everyone's good to go. Go. 
get it running, get it running. Go. Check it, fix it. Go, get it fixed. seconds. What drill is this going to be? Uh, first one's going to be a non-standard reaction. Okay. So that means you're going to put two rounds on, two, three, four rounds. You're going to say, oh shit, it's not working. You're going to make that conscious decision now to concentrate all of your rounds, whether it's an additional three, four, five, six, all in one area to try to defeat that body armor. Who's For the first one. For the first one, we're going to do non-standard reaction first. Okay, good. All right, shooters, ready? Fire! Ready? Non-standard reaction. Non-standard reaction. Shooters, ready? Five. Alright, good job, guys. Better? Yes, that was better. Thank you. Alright, and what we're going to do is now the zipper drill. So you're going to shoot two, three, four rounds, say, oh shit, it's not working. And then you're going to make that conscious decision now to drop, them, drop the rounds into the pelvis and then walk it up. And only move as fast as you can have effective hits. Okay? Any questions? Alright, shooters, ready? Shooters, ready? Shooters, ready? Five. So the first one we're going to do is non-standard reaction. Try to keep everything in that box. You see the box right there by, uh, where the heart would normally be? into that chest area. Any questions? Shooters, ready? Five. the 
that thing will happen. Structures, non standard reaction, non standard reaction. Shooter, ready? Fire! So you come out the holster and you've made a conscious decision to shoot, right? Don't get the desired effect. You're going to come down to the pelvis area. So what we're looking for is that, that actual, that track, okay? That vertical um, track starting in the pelvis area working itself out. You can actually see a line. You see what I'm talking about? That's what we're talking about. If you have any more than three, four, six inches in between rounds, then you probably need to slow down a little bit and actually walk that gun up. All right? Any questions about that? All right, so it should look something along those lines. All right, let's try that real quick. All right, women make horrible carpenters? Why? You've always been told this is six inches. Shooters, ready? Shooters, ready? 
Thanks, guys. Try it on everything and see what works. And then you have to find one. 
one way of doing it that kind of works across the board. Okay? And that's the important part. Just finding something that works. Here may be the best solution. Kind of just have, depends on circumstances and what you're wearing. Okay. Any questions? Okay. On safe. Ready? Fire. We're good. Yep. One more time. Ready? On safe. Ready. Fire. Center mass hits. Try it again. Safe. Fire. All right. Feels good. Clear that. Yes, sir. Chamber clear. All right. Weapons clear. All right. Here Thank you, you very much. Get out and get some training. Keep training, keep learning, keep watching.